Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the Mitch Trubisky Player Franchise. This is episode 89 in our last game of the regular season. Um, last game of the regular season. I forgot what I was saying. We are taking on the Colts. Um, I'll give you a hint. I'm not going to put up those stats again. The 543 yards, 8 touchdowns. That was an impressive game last, last episode. If you missed it, go back and check it out. If you're new here to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Um, but we are playing the Colts. I am Mitch Trubisky only. Nobody else on the offense or defense. So I'm only controlling the quarterback. We're going to start off in a three-point hole. Um... Honestly, this isn't even a must-win game. We've already guaranteed the number one seed in the NFC. So I could lose this game, and it really doesn't matter. But after that, we're facing a third and seven. I'm going to apologize now if I seem like I'm a little distracted. I'm not. Um, this game's going to kind of suck because we're down to three healthy wide receivers, which nobody got open at that time, so I take a sack. So we get the ball back uh, with a minute 30 left in the first quarter. Our three healthy wide receivers are Emmanuel Sanders, Cooper Cup, my top two. So that's not a really that big of a deal. I think it's Emmanuel Sanders. Um, yeah, it's Emmanuel Sanders, Cooper Cup, and... Uh, I think his name is Dwight Lowry. He's like our fifth string wide receiver. He was on our team last season. I barely threw to him. He's on our team again this year. We still got a healthy tight end, so Gabriel Carey's still out there. So we still got weapons. I can still figure out how to beat these Colts. See right there, nice throw to Gabriel Carey over the middle. But it just sucks. Um, I don't got the weapons that I like. We're missing, uh, who the, f oh yeah, we're missing Tajay Sharp, why was I thinking somebody else, we're missing Tajay Sharp, we're missing Glenn Dobson, he healthy at wide receiver, that's basically it, we got Travis Slay out of the backfield, we got Sajay Perrin, who's turned into a pretty decent runner, uh, out of the backfield, and then we also have the rookie, uh, what's his fucking name? Dalton Dol Vaughn or... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's Dalton Vaughn. I think it's D-Vaughn and it stands for Dalton. Come on. Oh, damn, I thought you were going to get in there at the end of the quarter. Take a nice lead. That's the end of the first quarter. We barely played any, any of the game. Um, but we're uh, down 3-0 in field goal range, so we can at least tie it up as long as I don't throw an interception or fumble the ball here. Um, but second and goal at the two-yard line. Going to hand it right back off to Dalton Vaughn for the touchdown. Our offense gets the ball back and retakes the field. There's five ten left in the game. Nice, solid six-yard run by Travis Slay to start things off in the second quarter for our offense. We're going to be running it a lot more than I normally do. I'm not going to try passing it for a whole bunch of yards today. Um, so it's going to be really up to our running game to really determine, God fucking damn, to really determine who's going to win this game. A nice interception there by the Colts. They leads to a field goal. So now they're down six to seven. So we still got a lead, 420 left in the game. My favorite number as we push our way for the first down, pick up all about 12 there. Uh, ball at the 37 yard line, first and 10 out of shotgun. Mitch Trubisky drops back, looking for a guy wide open. Oh, God damn, I should have thrown it to my running back. I think I could have fit it in the pocket right there. He had the spacing in the zone, but I just threw it to the wrong guy. But there's going to be a holding penalty anyway, so who gives a shit? Goddamn offensive line. It's shit like this that makes me want to leave San Francisco. But 
I'm basically playing with a new team next year because I guarantee they don't resign a bunch of these my receivers. So let, uh, most likely I only have um, Tajay Sharp back as a receiver next season. Everybody else is gonna be gone. Where's Travis Slay? Nice catch over the middle on first and twenty. Pick up of sixteen, second and four. Second and four out of shotgun by tight end, wide open over the middle of the field. Does he have the speed to make it to the end zone? Looks like he does. Our offense retakes the field with 319 left in the second quarter, up 14 to 6. And Travis Slay opens things up on this drive with a solid about 11 yard run. Pretty good. Travis Slay's having a good game. That's what I like to see. I like to see my running backs actually trying. Oh, God, fuck. Oh, damn it. Another mistake by me. I am not having the best game. The Colts offense scored a touchdown and uh, turned it into a one-point game. So a screen pass here to my running back. Pick up of about eight, nine yards. So second and one, 220 left in the first half. Hand it off right back to my running back. Nice pickup of five down at the 39-yard line. First and 10. We're going to be looking for a full running back out of the backfield on this play here. Oh, no, we're going to hand it off to him again. And he's breaking tackles. This is his best game he's had all season. If he would have played like this all season, I would have easily got him a 1,000 yards rushing. But um, I don't think I had a running back get even 500 yards rushing because of how not consistent they were. Dalton Vaughn breaking tackles. Nice 9-yard pickup there on first down. Three carries, 23 yards, one touchdown. The rookie, he should have been my number one running back all season. Here's another good run. Pick up a four. First and ten. He also picked up a first down. So our offense is moving the ball like we should want to be. Um, the problem is me. I've been throwing too many interceptions. Going to find Sanders down at the 17-yard line. Pick up a 21 through the air. First and ten. We're in the red zone. Run, running back. Gets the handoff here. Pick up a two down at the 15. They're going to say three, but that doesn't make sense. From going from 17 to 15 is two. So fuck, fuck the people that count the yardage. They're retarded. All right, pick up a four there. So that should put us at a third and four. That doesn't even make sense. They're counting, so they're counting that as three? Whatever. There's Sanders wide open for the end and for the touchdown. Yeah, probably for the last time in the first half. Our offense is going to retake the field with 35 seconds left. We got the ball at our 21-yard line. You see me here dropping back. Finding Gabriel Carey for a nice pickup onto the Colts' side of the field. We're going to use our first timeout. That was a huge pickup. Probably about 40 yards. I could probably do the math, but that would be too difficult for me. So, Gabriel Carey has four catches, 138 yards. He got a big chunk of them in that last play. Oh, motherfucker! So, he reached right through my guy and got the interception. That's bullshit. So, we turn it over. Get the, okay, so this is going to be our final drive of the first half. We'll get the ball with seven seconds to go. A quick handoff here to Travis Slay. We're going to use the timeout just so we can get one more carry. Um, squeeze in a couple. We're trying to squeeze in as many carries as we can for him before the season's over. Second and ten. Handoff here to the running back. He's going to not pick up. Pick up three. That's going to be the final play of the first half. We're up 21 to 13. Feeling pretty good. Um. The big thing for me right now is the three interceptions. 
I don't know what was going on when I was playing the game. But uh, I've made quite a few bad decisions out there. With the way I've been turning the ball over. So hopefully after halftime, we fix that and play a better second half. And we're back in the second half. We get the ball to start things off. So we're at our own 25-yard line. Up 21-13. to 13. Uh, Travis Slay opens things up with a 4-yard carry there. He has 10 carries for 60 yards. Plus whatever he's done in our passing game. Because he is also a threat through the air. Not him throwing, but him receiving. So right here he's out running that linebacker. I'm going to find him in stride. And he's going to take that all the way to the end zone. Because he's got this goddamn speed. Sorry if I got a little carried away on the last play. Um, I was just frustrated for the first half that uh, nothing was going for us in the passing game. Come on, stay on your feet. Oh, God damn it. That was a great carry by uh, our starting running back, Sajay Perrin. I was surprised because he has not shown like, many flashes all season. See, so he's been doing shit like that. Pick up a one. But yeah, I was pretty frustrated with the first how the first half played out. Um, I didn't have a great passing game in the first half. So when we come out in the second half and right away we throw that touchdown, like a huge touchdown, a lot of yards. It feels good. So I get excited about that. So that's why I probably got a little carried away with my excitement. We're going to scramble here. Spin move. Damn it. <laughs> That was a solid 11-yard run. Enough for the first down at the 28-yard line. Still up 28-13. to 13. We're going to find Emmanuel Sanders. Once again, pick up a 14. Enough for another first down. All right. We've got Sajay Perrin back in the backfield. Out of shotgun. Drop him back. We're going to find Cooper Cup. He's in for the touchdown. And with a minute 13 left in the third quarter, the 49ers offense retakes the field at the 20-yard line. We're going to start things off with a three-yard rush, which doesn't sound like it's exciting, but when he gets tackled right at the off line of scrimmage and he still pushes forward for three yards, that's called um, some pretty nice running. Did you see me get some blocks in there? Third and six. After those two okay runs. And on third and six, did we pick up the first down? Yeah, we did. Picked up enough for the first down. First and ten out of shotgun. We're gonna find Dalton Vaughn down at the forty-nine yard line. His first catch of the game for fourteen yards. We're gonna hand it off here to the running back. Who's gonna pick up nothing? They're gonna say maybe he won. Second and nine. All right, that's the end of the third quarter. We're up 35 to 13. I was going to say 38. 35 to 13 in the fourth and start of the fourth quarter. We're winning. Our last game of the season. We're all, well, keep breaking them. Ah. We're, this is going to be our last game of the season. We're going to end up 15 and 1 if we can hold this lead. Which that one loss, we probably should have won. So, we're feeling pretty good about heading into the playoffs on this hot streak that our offense is on. Our defense is playing well as, as well. Second and 10 at the 18 yard line.
five minutes left in the fourth quarter. And then we'll be done with this game. Come on, Vaughn. Va oh. My boy, D. Vaughn. First name D, last name Vaughn. You say it as one word, D. Vaughn. I'm just going to scramble this motherfucker and... God oh, damn it. <laughs> I was trying to spin. First and goal at the three-yard line after that fucking great scramble by me. They're going to leave Kerry wide open on this play. There we go. Howdy, Judy folks. We got four minutes left in the fourth quarter. This game just keeps feels, it feels like it's kind of dragging. The Colts' offense isn't getting anything moving, so they're not eating a lot of clock. My offense is scoring way too fast because we're apparently not eating enough clock either. Why did I keep that highlighted there? Okay. Um, yeah, so we're not eating enough fucking clock. So this shows... Oh, there we go. 3.49... Left in the game. Why the clock stop? There we go. He's a good run for the first down. Pick up of a lot. Thirteen yards. First and ten at the forty-eight yard line. We're starting to eat up some clock by letting the clock run like that. The key here is: Am I going to score again? Sajay Perrin with eight carries for 40 yards today. Not terrible. Not great. Yeah, we're trying to run it now. We're eating up the clock. 2.38 left in the game. Just got to keep moving the ball. Keep moving the ball. Oh, you son of a bitch. How'd you drop that? That stopped the clock. Third and eight. So here I either pick it up or I go for it on fourth down. Because why, why the fuck would we punt? Scramble to your left. There we go. There we go. Look at this scramble. 46 yards. Yeah, that's right, bitch. You're not going to catch this. We're up 49 to 13. We still got two minutes to go, so... We're just going to call different stuff that we never call. See, see if it works. Who gives a shit? Next in the morning, two, two minute warnings. The clock's going to stop once again. Second and five. Second and five, I pick up the first down on that scramble there. Five carries for 88 yards, one touchdown. I am having quite a game on the ground. We're not going to be able to run on the clock like I thought. Well, we might be able to, but it's just going to be drag. It's just, it's just, it's just going to drag. Second and 11 after that one yard loss on that carry. Here we go. Come on, Travis Light. Damn it. Third and nine after that two yard gain. All right, I'm going to be looking for Gabriel Carey here over the middle. Nope, they're going to cover him. We found our receiver, but we're not going to pick up the first down. So fourth and two because we were short. We're going for it here on fourth. I'm just going to scramble once again. Got to get out of bounds because I was going to fumble. So good thing I got out of bounds. The guys who tried to cheat me out of having the ball. Just because their ground game's not the best. That's why we're throwing. Who the fuck called the timeout? 
What? Why are we calling timeouts? Second and six. We're going to drop back out of shock. Cooper Cup had it and then dropped it. What the fuck? It wasn't even touched. So third and six. I don't know what the fuck that's all about. Here we go, Vaughn. Oh, God damn it. Picked up nothing. I should have just handed it right back off to him again. We're going to find our backup tight end. Pick up the first down. We call a timeout for some reason. I don't know. We're at the 29-yard line with 13 seconds to go. Trying to score once again. Let's see what we can do. Quick timeout and eight seconds to go. Last play here, depending on how long it takes. Second and three at the 23-yard line. Looking for carry. I'm just going to scramble down at the 11. No more timeouts, though. So that's going to be the end of the game. A nice 49-point it's by us. They scored 13. A huge win. 36 points that I beat them by. And that's including the three fucking interceptions I threw in the first half. Which I thought was going to kill a team, but the Colts offense was that bad. Or, all, or, or, or our defense was that good. One of the two. I don't know which one it is. So next we're going to be playing the playoff game. Um, so the playoffs are going to start. We'll do that. And then we have, to, we have to decide what we're going to do after the season ends. So if you enjoyed today's episode, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. It really does mean a lot when you do. Um, and I'll see you here next time. For the playoff game that we're going to be playing.